Ha. LA surf check. It's about hope, really. <laughs> Having a lot of hope. <laughs> and imagination. We are at the famous Bay Street here in Santa Monica, um, you know, Los Angeles, where the Dogtown and Z-Boys kind of were famous for. There's like a cool little pier situation going on out there. Not much to write home about wave-wise, but I'm gonna go get wet. It's the morning and it's so important for me to get in the water before I start my day. So I'll take what I can get. Let's get out there. What's up everyone? I'm Cassia Metter and I have pretty much been a lifetime free surfer. I have a wetsuit company. I you know, create wetsuits by women for women, lead retreats, supporting people in all aspects of their surfing journey, and just grateful to be here with you all. You know, rain, I've been working with the Heights uh, since they started the company, you know, pretty much since day one. It's been a fun journey and it's been a, you know, cool to see them grow as a company. And I think it's also some of the things that keep me inspired and keep me pushing forward with starting my own company because you see people that believe in something and they're making it and they're collaborating with different people that they're inspired by and pushing them to grow. So it's just been fun to be a part of since day one and to continue to be a part of. Back in the day, they used to have a thing called cribs and now it's vans. What's up and welcome to my van. And I have a business, you know. Um, I needed a commercial cargo van to do things like take around a lot of surf wax. I need to be able to sleep in it. I want to be able to carry my surfboards around at all times, you know. It's both modular, easy to use. It can be a cargo van. It can be a van life van. It can be the holder of all my surfboard van. It can be my vehicle van. And uh, just creative engine. Owning a small business at these times in our lives and wanting to still get out and surf and do my thing just makes having a van like really a clutch part and allowing me to do what I do and run a business successfully. Cassia Surf is a brand that I started when I left the professional surf world. And I had been in the industry for about 13 years at that point. I was in my early 30s and I was kind of like, man, I really wanna do something different. I wanna create something not for the child I was, but for the woman that I was turning into and also my peers and my friends and my community. I felt like there was a lack in the surf world for really supporting women that were interested in conscious products made by women for women. The key to happiness, I think, is doing the things that you love and, and keeping true to that and just being radically out there, just allowing yourself to go through it all, you know, to put things out there if you're inspired or empowered by them and, and to see where it takes you. 